Hey everybody, welcome to my debrief of my long solo cross-country flight. It was the most fun I've ever had. Um, we went, well, I'll, I say it in the video so I won't do too much like pre-talking about it. Um, I'll only show the uh, approach, or excuse me, the departure, the approach into the airports, um, and then San Luis Obispo, Oceano, that full flight, which is a couple of minutes um, and cut out the, um, the longer cruise portions because it's just a long, it's a three and a half hour video. So we'll cut it up to be a lot shorter. Um, and basically I'm just going to scrub it. I'm just going to fast forward through it. Um, if there's anything that you guys have questions on or want me to rewind or talk about, uh, in the video as we're going through it, let me know and we can back it up or look at something. Uh, my landing in Van Nuys was terrible. Uh, I made a bunch of mistakes on the radio. Uh, there's a handful of things that I did wrong that I can improve on, so I'll be really happy to rewatch this and see where I can make improvements. So that is kind of my goal here is to really focus on things that I can improve, improve on. So if you guys have any comments throughout the video, let me know. Um, the training is going along very well. Ed, um, I've got like, I mean, I'm just right there. I have like one solo flight left to do, take the written, uh, check ride prep, and then we'll get the check ride scheduled. So I'm really, really close. This was a huge, huge thing that we were waiting to do and very happy to have it done. So I'm going to get this video playing take off, um, from John Wayne. If there's any portion again that you want to go back or skip or anything, let me know. But I think the flight from John Wayne to Van Nuys is pretty good. Uh, it's not too long, and I'll just keep that one going, and um, then we can cut it up once we get out of Van Nuys. So yeah, <laughs> we can rewind and watch the uh, the Van Nuys landing a couple times. Possibly Chinese. Happy Friday! All right, let's do it. Let me know how the audio sounds, too. How's it going, everybody? Welcome to John Wayne and Skyhawk 53176. Today is my solo long cross-country flight. We're going to go from John Wayne to Van Nuys via the special flight rules, then from Van Nuys to San Luis Obispo, and then Oceano, and then back to John Wayne. So it's a pretty... Um, Pretty long flight for a solo long cross country, but I need the time and this is going to be a lot of fun. Prepped a lot using X-Plane and Pilot Edge, so I feel ready to go on this flight. So we're going to be heading out on a 220 heading out of below 2400 feet, and then we'll get the rest here from clearance. We've got information, Papa. That's bleed over, I think. John Wayne Clarence, good afternoon. Skyhawk 53176 with information Papa at ACI West, like flight following to Van Nuys at 4,500 via the special flight rules. Aircraft going to special flight rules. Call sign, type aircraft, please. Call sign is Skyhawk 53176, and we're a Charlie 172 slant golf. 53176 on departure, turn right heading 220. Maintain VFR conditions out of below 2,400. Visor frequency 125.35. Squawk 0235. 0235. Okay, and departure that's right heading 220 out of below 2,400. Departure frequency 12535. Squawking 0235. 53176. 176, read back correct. Papa's current safe parking. Hey, we've got Papa and we've got Papa and we're over at ECI West. 53176. Ground one two zero point eight. ACI West. Affirmative ACI West. Okay, on the tower side, right? Yeah, affirmative. Yeah, we're just poking out from the hangars right now. Ground one two zero point. All right, going to ground one seven six. Thanks. Who else called? Okay, so yes, we've we got you. our clearance. Let's get the gyro lined up here, and we're two two zero, and we're going to be at or below twenty six hundred, which is in there. We are squawking 0235, 
Walker 6, Rumbro, man. 3, Milwaukee, 5, Finn, alt mode. Departure. And the departure frequency is 1, J 2, 5, 46, 3, 5. The dicey intersection. And direct. that's just in there, so we remember it. And then we're ground point 8. I don't care what you're doing. Say that again. One okay. Taxi back, terminate. Just five Charlie Sierra, turn left to the hotel. Ground Skyhawk 53176, ACI West with Papa Taxi. Sister 53176, General Ground Taxi via Bravo Tower Run Up. Bravo Tower Run Up 53176. Okay. Brad, get the thumbs up from Brad, we're ready to go. Tower Run is running. Sweet. Oil temperature is coming up. One is refueling a helicopter. Right is clear, left is clear. All right. So special flight rules transition to Van Nuys. This is an airport that I've been dreaming about uh, landing at for a very long time. And the left side, uh, one six left is closed until December. So by default, um, I will get one six right, which is the the famous, the famous one. So I'm excited for that, uh, to say the least. Um, <laughs> this is awesome. This is going to be a great, fun day. And thank you guys, however you're watching this, whether it's uh, broadcast on Twitch or on YouTube, or even if it's you're my dad and you're watching this on a private link, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, hopefully this will be smooth sailing and a lot of fun to watch, uh, even if it's anywhere near how much fun this is going to be to actually do. So 10, uh, I'm just going to get a quick nav here. It's 10.8 uh, is the VOR that we're going to follow. And that's on the 132 radial, so I want the reciprocal of that. There's 132, so that's that's that. We're going to be up at 4,500. Okay, so that's all the stuff that I really want to get done for, uh, for the flight. That is twisted, and that's going to be annoying. want no distractions okay so before takeoff uh, brakes are set free and correct controls that looks good that looks good gentlemen ground runway two zero right taxi alpha looks good short ugly fuel selectors on both cutoff is in mixture we're good elevator runner trim uh, we've got that's good. Okay, enrich in the fuel a little bit. Check the mags. Coming up to 1800. Left one's got a good drop. Right one's got a good drop. Okay, everything is in the green. Check idle. The amp should click down once you're past 700 RPM. Alternator cutoff. And that looks good. Okay, so we got 26.8 ready to go here. Uh, we've got uh, autopilot is the altimeter, or um, altitude is set really high so we don't get beeped at a bunch. 235, we're going to be uh, 220 heading, and we've got 20 identified. We're good. Okay, that completes our pre takeoff checklist and we'll flip over to our takeoff checklist and all that stuff. Ground Skyhawk 53176 continue. This is 176 runway 20 right taxi via Bravo Kilo. Bravo Kilo 20 right 53176. Tier 3 Bravo Charlie monitor tower 126 okay. We are three, Bravo. off the big, the big boy runway right is clear Man, 
it's a perfect day today. It's probably going to get even more perfect as we go further north and out of the basin. The visibility should improve. It seems and like it's ground from 955 hotel. We're on 30, 40, go from here. somewhere in that range down here, but it'll, hotel, Alpha, it'll probably hotel, get unlimited. Charlie, so. Taxiway, Lima. All right. Okay, got it. Alpha Hotel. Let's check out the uh, short, the fun part. Uh, clock uh, three miles opposite direction inbound now at 1,000. Another helicopter. Searching copter 969. After through an extra radar contact, uh, five miles west of Java Airport. Traffic 12 o'clock, two miles opposite direction. Another helicopter 700. Verify, are you at 1,000? Yes, 1,000. Copter 31 X-ray. Cessna 5, Charlie Sierra. Traffic on the uh, upwind is also in the pattern. Follow them. Runway 20 left uh, at Kilo. Clear for takeoff. Zero left at Kilo. Clear for takeoff. It's like United is going to get sent first. Right, 96 Lima traffic in sight. <laughs> Busy Helicopter today. 96 Lima. Roger. Radar service terminated. Squawk 1200. Frequency change approved. Good day. Copter 96 Lima. United 1492. Runway 20 right. Full line. Clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 20 right, United 1492. Okay, 20 at 507 uh, at uh, Lima, cross runway 20 left, full shutter runway 20 okay. right. Okay, at Lima, cross 20 left, and uh, one turret to your right, come check follow that. Helicopter 31 X-ray, uh, cool. the other helicopter has you in sight, 12 o'clock, less than a mile. Report beam, South Coast Plaza for pad 4, Java at altimeter 2, 9 or 9 or 8. Roger, report beam, South Coast Plaza, copter 31 X-ray. John Wayne Tower, Cessna 609 through Juliet, signal peak, uh, inbound from touch and go. Wow, there's a Cessna lot of traffic. 5 John Wayne Tower, runway 20 right at Kilo, uh, line up and wait, traffic's on a five mile final in Embraer. Okay, line up and wait, 20 right, 53176. 9 Juliet, John Wayne Tower, go to signal peak for spacing, then make left traffic, runway 20 left, couple aircraft in the pattern. 9 through Juliet. That's 27 Alpha, you can turn base, runway 20 right, circle land. got a 737 that just took off. Final Embraer, parallel runway, do you have it in sight? Uh, negative on that incoming traffic, uh, 20 left, clear to land. Okay, that's a 27 Alpha. No, use your call sign if you would on that, but disregard the traffic on final. You're well out in front of them. Runway 20 left, clear to land. 20 left, clear to land. 27 Alpha. That's 176. Caution weight 10 minutes. Early right turnout is approved. Runway 20 right at Kilo. Clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff 20 right at Kilo. 53176. Right. Contact Camera. Action. 1490. Mixture full rich. That's a one tango Alpha. Traffic okay. Caution weight turbines. we got to get up. Uh, earlier than this guy, so let's go full speed, we got a bunch of greens, airspeed is alive. That's a 9-3 Juliet, is this going to be a full stop? Negative. And we are up. Early turnout, let's get away from his wake too. Columbia 2515 Quebec, Jamaica, right continue. Wave to Julia. Continue. Two, five, one, five, back. Tower comes 58, 22, two out. Two, I zero, can right. see you, Julia, in the w in the door. Two, traffic ahead and to your left, left base for the pedal runway. They have <laughs> That's right, hilarious. Two, zero, right, clear, to land. clear to land, two, zero, right, comes 58, 22. Columbia 15, Quebec, you can continue slowing. Caution, wake, chip evidence. All right. Three, zero, five. So, <laughs> got to remember to text Brad when I land. Each stop. That's a 176 radar contact, maintain view photo below 2,400 say altitude. We're climbing through 500, 53176. Cessna 176 oh. radar contact, say altitude. We're climbing through, climbing through 700, 53176. Cessna 27 Alpha, hold should runway 20 right, remain this frequency. Hold short 20 right, we're going to figure it out. A little stuck mic. And tower 473 Bravo Charlie holding short 20 left, ready for our fire release. There's 473 Bravo Charlie, Jama Tower, Roger. Alright, it's a little bumpy. Jama Tower, Cock 2 and X ray, beam south coast plaza. Copy 3 1 X ray, pad 4 cleared to land. Pad 4 clear to land, copy 3 1 X ray. Gamma Jet 507, traffic's on a 3 mile funnel of Columbia, runway 20 right, line up and wait. Line up and wait, Gamma Jet 5. Yeah, it's a little, little hazy. Cessna 5 Charlie Sierra, traffic's 3 mile funnel for the pad of runways of Columbia, runway 20 left, clear for the option. And tower flex here, 470, 50 on the visit of 20 right. Remember 27 Alpha, without delay, cross runway 20 right at Juliet. Traffic's holding position, then ground one 20 right. Cross 20 right. It's the madhouse at John Wayne. Ground 27 Alpha. Number 5822, turn up the ground one 20 right. Ooh. 20.8, uh, compass 50. Big bumps. Columbia 15, Quebec, traffic ahead to your left, left base for the pad of runway. Look at traffic, uh, traffic 515, Quebec. This one tango Alpha, runway 20 left, taxi via Charlie Kilo. 20 left via Charlie Kilo, 921 takeoff. Gamma Jet 507, runway 20 right, clear for takeoff. 20 right, clear for takeoff, Gamma Jet 507. 
Columbia 15, Quebec traffic ahead and to your right. Okay, looking like good. Plaza. There's a helicopter landing here at the base of the tower, runway 20 right, clear to land. 20 right, clear to land, 2515, Quebec. Cessna 93 Juliet, extend downwind. Extend downwind, 93 Juliet. Awesome. Downwind tower, Cessna Okay, we're coming up on... Bravo Juliet, inbound to Signal Peak. On the beach here. In Papa, we like to do some pattern work. It's uh, hanging on to us for a while. 126.8, 93 Juliet. I guess I said that wrong. Contact tower, 119.9er. 119.9er, Roger. Ancestor 1 Tango Alpha, monitor tower now on 119.9er. He's, he's busy right now. 199, Ancestor 1 Tango Alpha. Okay, Challenger 95, 5 Hotel, German Territory left to Lima, hold short of runway 20 left. Okay, left on Lima, hold short, 20 left. Or, uh, 9 955 Hotel. Yeah, coming up on, 507, uh, coming up on a restriction departure. here. Departure, Gamma Jet 507. Black Shed 470, Jamming Tower, runway 20 right, clear to land, traffic touching down now, Cirrus. Okay, I want to get over right, to SoCal now. I want to go over the water. Cessna right. 176, Sagan, yeah. altitude. We've got 2,300, 53176. 176, radar contact, maintain VFR, auto 2,400. Contact SoCal, departure 125.35. Okay, going to uh, SoCal, 53176. And Challenger 55 Hotel at Lima, across your... SoCal approach, Skyhawk 53176, restricted 2400. 53176, SoCal approach, you can resume on navigation, maintain uh, VFR 4000. Okay, ONAV up to 4000, and we're going to be on the special flight rules to Van Nuys, 53176. And we're going to be on 2855 once we... Okay, so we're we're up to four thousand for five thousand, not four thousand five hundred. So let's keep a climb going here. Oh man, okay, we're just off the shore right now, and we got Huntington right below. Number one seven six. Awesome. One two seven point two. Good day. Man, it's like once you're up in the air doing it, you kind of like all the nerves go away. November 53176, contact approach 127.2. All right, 127.2, 53176. SoCal approach, Skyhawk 53176, 2800, climbing restricted 4000. Center 53176, contact approach 127.2. 272176. Didn't hit the flip. Number two, Bravo, with Mistake number one. Damn it. 1201 over the flyway for two Bravo with you. Thanks for the help. See ya. SoCal approach, Skyhawk 53176, 3100 restricted 4000. 53176 for Caliper, thanks. You can climb to 4500 for the special flight rules. Okay, up to 4500 for the special flight rules, 53176. Okay, so 2855. All right, let's check how we're doing here. Um, we are right on our line on four flight, hilarious. Uh, so that's good, and 4,500, we're looking good. So we're going to be on 2855, and we're going to make our calls, um, and then get ready for Van Eyes. And we'll have the ATIS for them, and uh, tower frequency ready to go as well. So for the ATIS on them, go... Twenty-seven fifty-five. Pilot review letter to Airman OTA VNY-10 regarding Van Nuys bid prior to departure. Advise on initial contact. You have information hotel. Hotel. Van Nuys Airport ATIS information hotel. One eight five one zero. 
Wind 110 at 5. Visibility 10. Sky clear below 12000. Temperature 32. 2.9er. Altimeter 2999er. Cool. Okay, altimeter is the same. ILS Zulu runway 16 right approach in use. Landing and departing runway 16 right. Runway 16 left is a temporary taxiway tango. Taxiway Bravo closes between Echo and South of Gulf. Personnel and equipment working adjacent taxiways and runways. Runway 16 right visual approach slope indicator out of service. Hazardous weather information for California or coastal water. Available on high water flight service frequency. Wow, it's pretty. It is imperative pilot's review letter to Airman LTA VNY-10 regarding Van Nuys SIDS prior to departure. Advise on initial contact. You have information hotel. Okay, so we got all of hotel. Okay, so there's coming up on 4,500. All right, so now we're going to be looking for the radial for the Santa Monica VOR, which got tuned in VOR1. This frequency has been very quiet right now. It's good. This is a Thursday, so it's relatively quiet versus... November 2A Whiskey, so kind of approach, how do you hear? And 2A two Whiskey, got you in the Charlie and so kind of approach. Roger. There's, the, there's Long Beach. Long Beach Airport. Say hi to High Wing. All right, so we're 4,500, cruising along. Sipping fuel, nothing to it. Special flight rules will be a little bit busier, just with the check-ins. Number 2A Whiskey, coming for 134.9. 34.9 for 228 Whiskey. Number 176 for radar service, terminated to squawk 1201, frequency change approved. Okay, frequency change approved, squawking 1201, 53176, we'll see ya. 1201, frequency change is approved to 2855. Special flight rules traffic, Skyhawk 4,500 northbound over Long Beach Harbor. Northbound, special flight rules. At LA special flight rules, Icon 632 Bravo Whiskey, uh, we're a red and white light sport, we're 4,500 uh, northbound too. We're just south of Elantra Park here, so you'll probably pass us, LA special flight rules. Okay, I'll keep my eyes out for you at 53176. Okay, great, thanks. He doesn't need to know my... We are doing about 85 knots. Okay, Roger. I'm doing about 105 right now, and I'll keep my eyes peeled for you. And you're, are you uh, close to a beam, Torrance? Uh, actually, we're uh, we're just past Torrance. Uh, we're just still most up to Elantra Park here, just south of Hawthorne. And if you want, we'll stay just to the right of the tower if you want to cruise by just to the left of the tower. 
Okay, that sounds good. I'll keep an eye out for you, and uh, I'll let you know when I got you in sight for that transition. Okay, thanks. And we're going into Santa Monica. Okay, cool. That'll be a fun drop down. All right. Good right now. Radial is not coming in yet, so I'm just going to stay stay heading on this uh, on this heading and get that radial coming in. So the the um, horizontal limits for this transition is the 405 freeway, which I can see right now in the beach, which you can see. So um, that makes it pretty easy. You don't really have to be super exact. Um, on this transition, on the other ones, you do have to be more exact, but this one, you you don't, you know, you squawking 1201, and you're on your uh, CTAF making the, the GPS calls, which that light sport guy, um, you know, we just kind of coordinate CTAF style, <laughs> figure it out, so. Got a helicopter on our 2 o'clock. Guy's cruising pretty high. Okay, I still don't see this guy, but um, he's going to be to the east of the tower, so he should be out of our way. And our radial is coming in right now for that 132 radial. But again, we don't have to be exact since we're um, ladder. The lateral limit is so big, but I try to fly it as exact as possible on that radial. Um, because why not? But in this case, shading a little bit to the west will give uh, this LSA a little bit more space, just in case. So we're being towards now. And special flight rules, Skyhawk 4,500 northbound, just a beam torrents. Special flight rules. And special flight rules, Icon 2 Bravo Whiskey, we're 4,500 northbound, and we're just gotcha. over the south complex, LA special flight rules. And Icon, I just have you in sight right now, or the Skyhawk behind you. Okay, cool, thanks. That was an Icon. I heard LSA, and I didn't really think too much about the type, but yeah, that's the little Icon, that's cool. And we're still coming in on our radial here. Now, there hasn't been any other traffic calls here. I'm still going to make um, make the appropriate calls. That guy called in over Hawthorne, uh, 405 interchange, and the uh, the north complex there. I have him in sight, um, but there's no other traffic on there, which is which is good. One of the times that I did this, it, it was like four other planes on this, which was a Mess. Okay. LA's looking pretty nice. Okay, we are almost on our radial here. Special flight rules traffic, uh, Skyhawk 4500 just over the Hawthorne 405 interchange, northbound 4500, special flight rules. Okay, so there's, there's our radial. And I'm pointed just right at uh, Santa Monica View are. There's the Hollywood sign. This is so cool. An LA special flight rules icon, two bra whiskey, 4.5, northbound over Manchester. Last call, drop it into Santa Monica, LA special flight rules. Okay. It's a so far, so good. There's the Sepulveda Pass. Have a, uh, have a good flight. Yeah, thanks, you too. Have a good one, guys.
Okay, so we are just coming up on LAX. There is a A3, no, uh, yeah, A380 down there. If you, um, Special flight rules, traffic, Skyhawk, 4,500 northbound, approaching Imperial Highway, special flight rules. And it is nice and quiet up here on the old SFRA. Yeah, there's some, there's some big boys down there. That is too freaking cool. Special flight rules, traffic. Traffic is 976 last Delta over Pacific Palisades, 3500. Going to cross over Santa Monica VOR, proceed southeastbound. Special flight rules, traffic. Skyhawk 4500 is over the north complex of LAX, northbound into Van Nuys. Special flight rules. And that icon, I just saw him smash down there. God, those A380s are gigantic. Okay, the Pacific Palisades guy, I don't see him. Hey, bird. Special flight rules, traffic, Skyhawk 4500, just approaching Bologna Creek, northbound special flight rules. Special flight rules, traffic, stripe is around 765 Delta. We are about a mile to the uh, Finbar, thank you so much for the subscription. 15 months, my god, Finbar, you are the best. Okay, I dude. do not see that guy. It's really hard to spot traffic against the all the houses and stuff. Yeah, we'll fix that, don't worry. Okay, we're almost over Santa Monica here. I still don't see that guy. Special flight rules, traffic, Skyhawk, 4,500 northbound, just over the Santa Monica VOR. This will be our last call. We're descending down into Van Nuys. Special flight rules. Okay. Van Nuys Tower, good afternoon. Skyhawk 53176, 4,500 just over the Santa Monica VOR off the special flight rules. Inbound with hotel for a full stop taxi back. Air 53176, Van Nuys helicopters. Are you, are you a helicopter or a fixed wing? Uh, we are a fixed wing, sir. Uh, Skyhawk 1, uh, 172 Slank Golf. 53176. Air 53176, Van Nuys Helicopters. Contact Van Nuys Tower, 119.3. Okay, sorry about that. 119.3, 53176. That's weird. Turkey 44566, right, full length. Bayer forward takeoff, traffic in the uplands for the east pattern. Takeoff, 526, left Van Nuys Tower, good afternoon. Skyhawk 53176, 4,500 just off the Santa Monica VOR and the special flight rules. Inbound with hotel for a full stop taxi back. Skyhawk 53176, Van Nuys Tower. Roger, enter uh, right traffic, pressure make right traffic for 916 right. Okay, right traffic for one, right traffic for 16 right, Skyhawk 53176. Sweet. Right, cleared for immediate takeoff. Okay. 16 right, cleared for immediate takeoff, 8 Delta Hotel. All right, and uh, so pattern altitude is 1800. Fire to arrive, we'll make uh, one shallow S turn to the left. So here we go. S turn to the left to zip up. Embraer 7 Lima Lima, turn base, we're now on 6 right, continue. 7 Lima Lima, freeway in sight, turn to the base. Just on 2 zero pop, we're now on 6 right, clear, touch and go, wind 1006. 2 zero pop, it will be a full stop, 1 6 right. 2 zero pop, we're now on 6 right, clear to land. Clear to land to zip up. So we screwed up the uh, tower frequency. That's okay. 
Seven star three six seven uniform zero nine star make straight in our nine one six right squawk zero two six four. Zero two six four. Okay, we're coming into one six right. This is crazy. This is insane. Okay, eight hundred feet pattern. Uh, eight hundred feet. Um, field elevation eighteen hundred foot pattern altitude. Roger that. We'll keep uh, reduced speed. Thank you. Keep that shit. And uh, leader 342, Sierra Papa is holding short in sequence. 4310, Echo Fox, Trail 916, right, full length line of no way traffic, uh, Embryo 3 mile funnel. 16, right line of point, uh, 310, Echo Fox, Trail. 32, Sierra Papa, let's exit, make uh, uh, exit, uh, Gulf of my first no landing at Van Nuys a good one. one. Hotel 2, Sierra Papa to the ground. Yeah, this is just like the simulator. Flavor takeoff at the same. Another way traffic's uh, two miles on. Once it's right, clear for takeoff, no delay, right cross under the flood three one zero. Turkey four four five six six, contact local departure. Local departure one two four point six five six six. Let's see seven Lima Lima one six right, clear to land. Clear to land one six right, November seven Lima. Wind one two zero at four. Okay. Zero at four. Okay. Piece of cake. Roger, 342, Sierra Papa, Van Nuys Tower, expect 10 minutes. 2 Sierra Papa, Roger. November 5364, Kilo, Van Nuys Tower, still there. Okay, oh, we got some bumps coming off the mountains. Uh, 46826, Roger, extend down the base of the VA. Base of the VA, 26. Okay, this is where it gets traffic y, so keep your eyes peeled. Pay attention to who's coming. For 4830 November at Delta, are you ready to go? Off the runway. 30 November is ready to go. 4830 November, runway 16 right at Delta, line up and wait. Line up and wait uh, at uh, Gulf, 30 November. At Delta, 30 November. Thank you. Delta 926, continue traffic in position. Continue 826. Okay, continuing down to 1800, we're at 2500 right now. Ooh, it's really bumpy. Okay, we got a guy. Is he taking off or landing? Looks like he's. Cessna 6 Delta Delta, frequency change approved. Okay. Frequency change approved. Getting down to pattern altitude here. Lima Lima, exit right, contact ground 121.7. Can we exit left, please? Lima Lima, Roger, exit left is approved, contact ground 0.7. Lima Lima, exiting left, thank you. Okay, almost down. 46826, extend downwind, follow Diamond Star 4 mile final. Turn it back to Diamond, turn it back to 326. Okay, yeah. Somebody crossing the 101 freeway and right traffic, who's that? That's the Skyhawk 53176. Skyhawk 53176, Roger Squad 0227. 0227176. November 4830, November 1016, right at Delta, clear for takeoff. Left, South of the 101 freeway, 30 November. Diamond Star 367, uniform Sierra, reduce speed, traffic holding in position. Roger, reduce speed, uniform Sierra. Turkey 1064, X ray, turn left, intercept the 118, enter right base. Intercepting the 118, right base, 6 4 Skycatcher 5216, Lima, 16 right, full length, line up and wait. We are now in the pattern at Van Nuys. 116, Lima, 116 right, full length, clear for takeoff. 116, right, clear for takeoff, 116, right, And at the end, uh, the Mentor aircraft, who's that? That's a 341 Micromeo, ready to go. Uh, Roger, Mentor 341 Micromeo, we're now 16 right, full length, line up and wait. Line up and wait, full length, 16 right, Mentor 1 Micromeo. Mentor 1 Micromeo, traffic say uh, Diamond Star 2 miles, I'll be ready to go. 1 Micromeo. Cessna 826, you have the uh, Diamond inside ahead of you? 8826. Cessna 826, Roger, number 2, follow Diamond Star. Follow Diamond Star 826. And that's tower uh, 8405, you guys follow this. Okay. Roger, 8405, again. Okay, we're beaming the numbers now. Roger, 8405, 8. 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 Roger, 8
Take off one mic, Romeo, right crosswind. Second, your 526, Lima, turn 20 degrees to the right. 20 right, 165. Diamond Star 7, uniform Sierra, 916 right, clear to land, departing mentor. Watch these right, clear to land, I have the aircraft. Now 46826, number two, fall mentor, correction, fall at Diamond Star, runway 16 right, cleared to land, wind 1206. Okay, you got both of them in sight. Number two, one strike, clear to land, 826. This place is a mess. Turkey 310, Fox traffic, change approved. They had a white leg and Brett. Change approved, 310, Fox traffic. Number uh, 176, turn right base, follow Cessna, one mile final, runway 16 right, clear to land. Okay, right base, we got that traffic in sight, clear to land number 353176. Mentor 1 Mike Romeo, say departure request. Right crosswind, I have the sky catcher in sight, white Mike Romeo. Mentor 1 Mike Romeo, roger, maintain a visual from the uh, sky catcher, right crosswind is approved. 1 Mike Romeo. 30 November, request frequency change. 30 uh, November, frequency change approved. 176, direct to the numbers. All right, numbers 176. Turkey 1064 X-ray, uh, continue through finals. Enter left down on Gulfstream and trail view. On the left down, it looks like Gulfstream will be hey, entering at a four-mile There we go, 16 right. Uh, Holy crap. Runway looking for traffic. You said got the guy just crossing. Piper 64, correction, uh, Piper 64 X-ray, continue. Okay, we got. And intercept the 405. Mixtures, let's. I don't have any lights either. Uh, Gulfstream 388 Mike Mike on the visual for 16. Gulfstream 388 Mike Mike, Granite Tower, runway 16 right, cleared line number 2, follow Cessna 1 mile final. Traffic uh, 3 mile final is a Piper eastbound, they'll be following you. 8 Mike Mike, Roger. And it's bumpy on final here. Clear to line and My right. hands are sweating. Take your 5216 Lima, frequency change crew. Mentor, one mic room. Okay, make sure we've got all of our lights are on. Number 826A from a taxi hotel, contact ground 121.7, thanks for help. Good day, sir. Number 2, sir, Papa, will be uh, just a couple more minutes for you. 2, sir, Papa, Roger. Okay, we're nice and... 367, uniform CI, can I contact nice ground? nice and slow here. 367, uniform CI, from the ground 121.7, good day. Good day, good day. 01064 X-ray, you can uh, turn left back to finals. Gulfstream is now two and a half miles final reporting out in sight. Turning back left onto final, 64 X-ray. Pull up. Pull up. Freaking Van Eyes, one six right, huh? Go straight, Mike. Mike, traffic's over numbers. Running one six right, clear to land. Wind one two zero five. Clear to land, eight five Mike. Ooh, Andre, float float out. You'll be uh, next to go VFR. Five, Nitro zero five. What's the departure request again? Bounce. Uh, Burbank zero five. That was not very smooth, but number one seven six. Contact ground one two one point seven. All right, twenty one seven five three one seven six. Five four six four X-ray. Continue traffic. will Be holding in position. Whew, I am sweating right now. Let's look at that in instant replay. <laughs> All right, so uh, the debrief portion of this, um, and thank you everybody for watching this. This is super fun. Um, oh, hi, Wing. You've never been to Van Nuys. It's super. I mean, it's super cool to say you've been there, at least to me, because I've just up. had it in my head Pull for so up. long. Um, Krshin, Kershin, um, welcome. Thank you for the follow. Epically. Epic, um, that is an awesome Pull username. Up. Thank you as well. Ben Barr, thank you for the follow. Um, Sierra Gulf, Sierra Gulf Fox. Sorry, my the little notification is like it's hard to read with the blue sky in the back. So I apologize um, for butchering those names or going off camera. Um, Finn Barr, thank you for the gifted sub to Agent B Seven. Um, all right, so the landing into Van Nuys was an uh, interesting one. 
Van Nuys was really, really busy. And, you know, like High Wing said, it's, uh, you know, I've never been over here, so I, I don't know the the um, the volume that that they usually see for GA, but it was very busy. So I was number three in the pattern coming in. There were jets taken off. There was a mentor taken off. All kinds of stuff happening uh, just to get into Van Nuys. There was a plane that was departing underneath me, 500 feet. Uh, just crazy. Uh, the other thing, and and part of that busyness is because one six left was notumed closed, and it'll be closed until December. So they're doing a bunch of stuff to it. Uh, it's actually a taxiway right now. I think if uh, I, I think they renamed it. I, I don't remember exactly what the particulars of the notum were, but there's a couple of things here that are kind of uh, kind of goofy that you can see just from this shot right here. The first thing is, like I said, there's no uh, precision landing light, so no Pappy, no Vazzy. I You're just going off of experience on what your glide slope needs to be. And for a student pilot, that experience is a lot smaller. <laughs> Quasar, how's it going? Thank you very much, Quasar. Thanks for, for joining. And Ninja with Guitar, hello. So, uh, tendency to be, I don't know. I don't know what, I mean... A CFI would, I mean, Brad could probably tell me one hey, or the other. Hey, bird. Whoa, buddy. Quasar, thank you so much for 13 months. That's, dude, that's crazy, Quasar. Thank you very much, sir. So my hand, my palms were so sweaty. It was crazy, like, how nervous I was coming in here and, like, focused on doing everything right. Um, so... I, I don't really know what happened on this landing. I it was just just I just bounced it. It wasn't a violent bounce or anything. It was just not that smooth. So you know I was looking down the runway. Center line was fine. I got it um, slowed down pretty quickly. So like my speed was okay. I wasn't going too fast. It just you know I don't know. So let's look at that one more time, and you can count the bounces. It was pretty pretty bad. Two and a half miles on reporting out in sight. Back left onto final six four extra. And the displaced threshold does kind of throw you off a little bit too. Freaking Van Eyes one six right, huh? Go straight, Mike Mike. Traffic over numbers. Running one six right, clear to land. Wind one two zero five. Clear to land, eight five Mike. Ooh, yeah, okay. So I, I overflared it a little bit, let it flow, and then just kind of bounced it down. But, you know, the airspeed was okay because I'm, I'm off right here. Um, you know, that was... That was not very smooth, but... Number 176, contact ground 121.7. All right, 2175 Number 64X, right, continue traffic, will be holding in position. Whew, I am sweating right now. Okay, so I will go away now. Webcam, that will go away. Van Nuys Ground, Skyhawk 53176, clear of 16 right at Gulf for a taxi back. 53176, Van Nuys Ground behind the Cessna, running 16 right, taxi via Alpha Charlie. Okay, Alpha Charlie 216 right, 53176, and can we coordinate uh, flight following with you on the ground? Uh, Cessna 16, affirmative, say the request. Going to uh, San Luis Obispo at six at six thousand five hundred five three one seven six. Oh man, warm, terrible landing at Van Nuys. And ground Gulf Stream 380, Mike Mike guys uh, on Bravo going to Western Jet. How cool is this? Or 388, Mike Mike, Van Nuys Ground Taxi, Western Jet via Bravo. Or 8 Mike Mike, Western Jet via Bravo. Number 176, advise and ready to copy. 
Uh, ready to copy, 53176. 71176, right crosswind at the basin. Contact SoCal departure 134.2 and squawk 4635. 4635. Okay, so that is a right turn at the basin. Contact approach at 1342 and squawking 4635, 53176. 71176, read back correct. Awesome. Ground up 44 clear, Bravo. Mm -hmm. uh, 44 right. Okay, 444, November Charlie Nine Star Report. Bull Creek 101. Four, six, three, five. Four, six, two, three, five, with Delta Van Ice Tower. Helicopter three, Papa Delta, you can make a static play arrival and uh, report about Boa. Okay, so if we have a little bit of a delay on the departure, we might be okay and not have to wait in the run up, but let's see what uh, what it looks like. I'm going to stop on Alpha, and I think we should be okay. Okay, so the Lear's going, and we got a 172 in front of us. I think he might be in the run-up area. Oh, that's a 206. India current, then I saw Timeter 2, Niner, Niner, Niner. Yeah. Okay. 34, 34, 2. 104 X-ray, then I saw Taxi Prop Park, the Alpha. Back and back to the Alpha, 64 X-ray. Charlie, Crossing Lake Turbulence, uh, traffic off your right, Learjet climbing to 4,000. Four number, Charlie, taxi Alpha, Group Stop 3, number one. to land. Okay, let's load the flight. Van Nuys. Van Nuys ground, signature east, sir. Oh, that Falcon is coming in. That looks sick. Signature east, sir, Van Nuys ground. East, sir, with the Learjet, it's going north on Bravo, ramp to ramp. Signature east, sir, we'll see you via Bravo. East, sir, on Bravo. Van Nuys ground, Lacey Tug. Clear Lacey Tug, Van Nuys ground. Lacey Tug with a citation 3 under tow. Like to go to Bravo 2 via Bravo. Play Lacey Tug, see via Bravo. Roger that, Lacey on Bravo. Clear ACV, Bravo. Clear ACV, Bravo, 7 Golf, Bravo, good day. Okay. Go over to the tower. Van Nuys Tower, Skyhawk, 53176, holding short number 2 for 1-6 right. 53176, Van Nuys Tower, Marine 1 strike, clear for takeoff. All right, clear for takeoff. One six right five three one seven six. Okay, Rick. So we got. Okay, and 
is in there, ready to go, we're squawking. And let's go lights, camera, and action. Clear to the left, clear to the right. And let's take off from Van Nuys, holy crap. This is awesome. Oh my god. Okay, right at the basin. So we're here, we're going up to 6,500. Okay, the so 1 6 is identified. Full power, we might take off before this threshold. Okay, everything is green. Airspeed is alive. We are flying. Cool. One six right. Tower red stripe. Done. Please, we'll be ready for departure. This is Van Nuys Tower. Thank you guys. Red stripe. Three Van Nuys Tower. Roger. Have your release. Okay. Ten Tower Craft India. Current drill center is two nine nine nine. Two triple nine nine. Okay. So we just hold this heading until we hit the basin. Wind one six zero at three. Tower Cessna four seven four six uniform ready for departure. Are we going east now? And four seven four six uniform Van Nuys Tower Roger, stand by. Standing by four six. Okay. There is our basin. And we are heading out to San Luis Obispo. Marsh up 003, safe walk. We are squawking 4743, red stripe 3. Oh, we're just right on our heading right now. Awesome. Red Stripe 003, no, just keep the 4743. Also, in future, if you do want us to update the time, just let keep us an know. Keep an eye out and, and set up uh, uh, a for the plan, Southwest 737. Time. Should be coming. Um, okay, so the Burbank the right Charlie side. is 3,000 like above the, us. I'm at 1 o'clock right now. Red Stripe 003, we're going straight. Line up away, just waiting oh, for our departure space in here. Line to wait, one six right, red stripe three. Okay, we got that Burbank traffic in sight. Coming right for us. For Julia to turn and only left crosswind for jet departure behind you. Left crosswind, seven for Julia. Right stripe zero zero three, traffic ahead as turning left crosswind for you. Cessna, no factor, Marine one strike, cleared for takeoff. For takeoff, one six right, red strike three. November 4746, uniform left, left crossing to prove south of the 101, out of below 2000, remaining 16 right, cleared for takeoff. Number 176, contact local departure. Okay, departure 53176, see ya. SoCal Departure, Skyhawk 53176, 2800. And I think we're back. Um, I don't know what happened there, but we uh, I don't know where it left, so 
We, I, <laughs> just me here now, uh, departed Van Nuys and got vectored around for some traffic, and now we are uh, heading direct to the San Marcos VOR, which is... 124.7, approach uh, We're just flying direct to San Marcos right now. Okay, so I'm going to pause that right there. Um, so what what happened is I found out, I edited together all of the clips, and it ended up being three and a half hour long uh, video file. Apparently, Premiere only lets you um, edit a video that I think is like an hour and a half long. So my like full super cut, I uh, wasn't able to go in and chop up all of the little things that I wanted to edit out, which were um, just like the times when I would turn the camera around and there was some like, I was screwing around with the camera a few times in during some bumps when I was on the autopilot. So I wanted to have like a clean version um, and I only was able to output this much before tonight. Um, so I'm gonna go over to the, the really long raw uncut one and basically get caught up to where we're at now. So for blow minimums, which hello, um, we'll just do a quick little recap of the, um, of the flight. Let's see, is it working? Okay. Yeah, there, there it is. Okay. So, da, 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 da. so leaving, leaving John Wayne up to 4,500, uh, special flight rules transition over LAX and then descend down into Van Nuys, deal with all this traffic, come in here, nice, smooth, gorgeous landing into Van Nuys. Taxi back, get flight following, wait for a Falcon to land, take off right at the basin, uh, avoid the 737, and now we're back up to uh, heading to the San Marcos VOR. Okay. Approach, good afternoon, Skyhawk 531 yeah, I'm not sure what that issue is either, I was, trying to look, I was trying to Google it. It shouldn't do that, so I'm going to try like closing everything and resetting, and hopefully I can go back. We're almost there. Because that would save me a lot of time if I could November 2 one Sierra, contact SoCal Approach, one three four. Uh, okay, so now we have a decision to make. Um, I, I talk a little bit when I'm up in cruise, and I, I think, I, I don't know, if you guys want to see some of that, um, I wanted to recap my the experience as it was happening um, and have a record of it just so I can go back and, and watch this and remember what it was like and what I was thinking at the time. Um, so we can watch some of that stuff or we can go uh, basically straight to the approach back into San Luis Obispo. And it was a pretty long, I mean, it was like a 40 mile straight in. Um, so it was a good, I mean, it was a good amount of uh, flying to be done to get in there. Um, so up to you guys. If you want to see some of, like, the cruise chat or just go straight to the arrival, let me know. And I can either jump to cruise chat or approach, slow approach. Okay, so we got one for approach. One's like, okay, two, that's probably enough. <laughs> I'm, that probably is a pattern anyway. <laughs> Oh, Jacob, though. Jacob uh, likes the cruise chat. Agent B7, go to the approach. All right. <laughs> Big boy Brian, what's happening? Uh, let's. Okay, so here's here's me blabbing about la, da, 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 Santa Barbara. There's that. Uh, more blob. More blabbing away. Na, na, na. Autopilot is a wonderful thing. <laughs> yeah, this is a 172, Brian. Yeah. Janigans is down for some cruise chat. I think this uh, thing is so long that it is frozen. This is going to be my dude for a little bit. Um, well, let's just see how these mountains are gorgeous out here. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do with all these freaking pictures, but I'm going to take I'm going to take them while I'm on autopilot. Um, Cuz it's freaking pretty. 
It's really pretty. Summer 6036 Golf Center. Well, Brian, uh, archers are God, such a cool place to fly around. There's so much variation in terrain, uh, different airspace and airports. And, yeah, I'm going to go from uh, a yeah. Charlie to a super busy Delta. Uh, over. I wish you could see what I'm looking at now. It is not what you're looking at. Oh, God. Oh, you're new here, Brian. Awesome, man. Well, welcome. I think my poor little... Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to get rid of X-Plane running in the background here. I think my my RAM is just like, dude, give me a break with all this video. Let me load it in. Flew out of John Wayne, went into Van Nuys, and now I am trying to get... Uh, get to the point of descending into San Luis Obispo. But I do need more RGB. That does usually solve the problem. Uh, Epically Epic. Uh, did his PPL in a Warrior. That's awesome. Only did one flight in a 172. So far, my commercial instrument are already... Oh, and already like it better. Interesting. <laughs> my PC needs more cowbell. A few times. Um, get in the real plane, and I just... I'm so comfortable with four flight now. Um, that... Just... I'm no, I'm three one seven six. Contact Santa Barbara approach one two. Oh, in general, yeah, I, um, I'm based out of John. Right, Twenty four one five five three one seven six. See ya. We only got a couple yeah, of. Want to play? See ya. Okay. Santa Barbara approach. Good afternoon, Skyhawk five three one seven six six thousand five hundred. Five three one seven six Santa Barbara approach San Luis Obispo altimeter two nine or nine or seven. All right, two nine or nine or seven five three one seven six. Thank you. Cool. Let's go Barrow two nine or nine or seven. Cool. All yeah, right. it is. It is. And we're game. Uh, we're <laughs> we're one in a three. Uh, working on my zero, private four heading. Brian. So I'm a little bit to the left of that. But there are some. There's some terrain here that. I kind of want to stay to the west of, so I'm going to three zero zero. Thank you. Thanks, Brian. Is going to be my dude for a little bit. Um, these mountains are gorgeous out here. Okay, there's that same that same spot, and it apparently just freaks out every time I get to there. What's happening? Is it really having this much trouble with this stupid video? Yeah, it like doesn't want to freaking. It doesn't want to. Oh, you know what? Quasar, that's why I was having problems uh, editing it because it it freaked out. <laughs> You're having a hard time hearing you over. Well, you. Allow myself to introduce myself. All right. That that actually makes a lot of sense. So I think I have a um, solution for that. That's uh, yeah, the corruption. <laughs> the corruption must be cleansed. But yeah, that's definitely what was going on there. So that actually makes me feel a little bit better that it wasn't anything that I was doing necessarily wrong. It's just that that file was corrupted. Frick. But we have an alternative that I will try to get going quickly here for you guys. Yep, this should work. Okay, I'm going to close this here. Thank you for bearing with me with all of these uh, technical glitches. Uh, this this won't be as smooth uh, with the tracking, but we're going to look at it right from, right from uh, Premiere. Okay, here we go. Here's the descent into San Luis Obispo for your viewing pleasure.
Bill, stop cutting Bill off. It wouldn't be the first time. Okay. I agree, Brian. Yeah, I agree. Okay, Beautiful so I'm going to go into... Uh, so we're 20, within 25 miles now. And we're going to go into Bill. Santa Barbara mode. departure, Caravan right, 805, Delta Zulu, 1.4, climbing 1, 3,000. We should be making, making uh, so seven, zero, landing seven, at Santa Barbara, Santa Barbara departure, or San Luis Obispo, right, exactly what I told them. I said, we, I'd be there about 2. Seven, zero, eight, zero, five, Delta Zulu, Santa Barbara it's, departure, look, it's like radar exactly contact, Santa Maria, two altimeter, 2, 9, or 9, or 9, or traffic in the pattern at... Uh, Vandenberg, left close traffic is a uh, King Air. Triple Niner and I'll be looking for that King Air 5 Delta Zulu. Number 5 Delta Zulu, the King Air is 1 o'clock and 3 miles southeastbound, converging at 1,900. Uh, look at 5 Delta Zulu. So we can slowly start our descent now. Number 707 Alpha Delta radar contact, 3 Northwest Santa Maria Airport, altimeter 29999. 29997 Alpha Delta. And we'd like to do another approach on the uh, RNAV 30 back to Santa Maria. Alpha Delta, Roger. Expect vectors in uh, five miles. Traffic 11 o'clock, six miles northbound, 3,000. Survey aircraft, Cessna 172, 2,900. Okay, look for traffic. Thanks. We'll accept vectors. Uh, seven Santa Barbara approach, Skyhawk 53176. We have uh, X ray at San Luis Obispo, and we're going to start our descent now. Alpha Delta survey aircraft now 2 o'clock and 3 miles northbound at 2,800. Look for traffic, Alpha Delta. Delta Delta. Traffic in sight, 7 Alpha Delta. We're 7 Alpha Delta, Roger. This one good. Okay, we got our at the Atus. Oh, and airport is in sight. That was way easier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> oh my god, that's so cool. That is really cool. Miles. Yeah, I don't need that beeping at me. Caravan 5 Delta Zulu, King Air traffic in the pattern of Vandenberg is no longer a factor. So we got 200 feet, 212 feet, cool and a 12 12 on the pattern altitude. So 12 12 and 200. 1-8 is checking in, passing 1,500 to 4,000. Wayland 1-8, Santa Barbara departure, ID. Look 4-9 or 6-3, Golf, Santa Barbara approach, say destination, the altitude you're going to cruise at. I feel like I hear...
radio bleeding into my headset. <laughs> the radios. That's weird. The six three golf squad zero one one one. Wayland one eight radar contact the uh, Vandenberg altimeter three zero zero one. Advise ready to copy. Three zero zero one and Wayland one eight is ready to copy. Wayland 1A cleared to the uh, Edwards Air Force Base via turn right heading 350. Expect vectors to send Marcus Victor 12 initial Palmdale direct. Arm and maintain 8000. Initial contact, give information x ray. We still have x ray. Wayland 1A is cleared to Edwards Air Force Base via right turn to 350, followed by uh, direct to uh, San Marcos Victor 12 Palmdale. Uh, direct Edwards, I maintain 8,000. Wayland 18, read back is correct. Start that right turn uh, quickly, please. You're getting into some hot airspace. And uh, what final altitude do you want to cruise at? Wayland 18, request a 15,000 expediting turn to 350. Roger, Caravan 5, Delta Zulu, jumpers away in one minute. Caravan 5, Delta Zulu, Roger. Attention all aircraft in the vicinity of Lompoc Airport, parachute jump operations about to commence directly over Lompoc, out or below 13,500 for the next five minutes, use caution. System 2472, Quebec, contact Santa Barbara approach, 125.4. Wayland 18, Santa Barbara approach, Skyhawk 53176, we have X-ray at San Luis Obispo Airport is in sight. Number 53176, contact San Luis Tower, 124.0. San Luis Tower, 243176, see ya. Ground runway 290, taxi out. San Luis Tower, good afternoon. Skyhawk 53176, 10 to the southeast with X ray, full stop. This is 53176, San Luis Tower, make straight in runway 290. Straight in runway 290, 53176. Turn to 8 right. whiskeys on the ground, safe. Quest exit at Charlie 4 ACI. 28 whiskeys, San Luis Ground, taxi V Alpha ACI. Okay, uh, straight yeah, into 2 9. Uh, and uh, Cessna 3558 Foxtrot, San Luis Ground, runway 2 9, attack to be off. And did you have a request? Man, it's awesome to be able to see that right, airport from so far back. Did someone else call? That really helps. Okay, let's do a pre pre landing checklist. So we've got seatbelts, we're, we're good here. Fuel selectors on both. Cutoff is in. Altimeter is good. Radios, we're already obviously talking. Autopilot is confirmed off. Hit the button a couple times just to be quadruple sure. We've got the runway in sight. And it's 2-9, I can bug the heading. And this is a... We've essentially been on like a 40 mile final. <laughs> okay, let's make this one nice. Sorry, let's go for a second. And yeah, we got a, a whiskey all screen. of our lights uh, are on. Taxi via mic for, and I'll try to run my two nine around the compass rose. Bond trim in here. Looking good. Still pretty good on the speed. Showing 110. I don't have any, really any wind right now. It's maybe a couple of knots of headwind. If that, but there is, there's center line. There's 2-9. I can't believe I'm doing this. I almost, almost just wanted to use the scroll wheel to yeah, zoom in to the right. airport, but I can't. Okay, let's... Did you want a VFR climb? Mixture is rich there. Yeah, we don't have that, so it'll just be, uh, you'd be... Clear to your destination airport for uh, via radar, I'm sorry, runway heading, vectors passive rovals direct.
climb VFR2 and maintain 8,000, and the rest is unchanged. Okay. Uh, all right, we've done two landing checklists. I'm going to do a third. Make so sure one, one, uh, then you're ready fuels on both, cutoff is in. Touch all aircraft information, Yankee is now current, oh. altimeter 2909 or 6. Okay, it's going down a little bit. Okay, on glide slope. One ten. So we're just, just at the uh, ten knot, ten degrees of flaps zone. But we're a little bit far out now. We're three mile final now. Zero eight, Mike's going around. Two zero eight, Mike. Roger, Mike. Left close traffic. Left close traffic. Zero eight, Mike. St. Louis Tower, Skyhawk, 53176, three mile final, 29. Skyhawk, right, 176, runway 29 or Clearland? Clearland, 29 or 53176. Eight up that last mile, we're now at two miles, 2.2. Getting some bumps coming off the fields below. My palms are sweating again. So five. Five four zero three Victor Center Ground Runway two nine Earth Taxi V L. Okay, first notch of flaps coming in. Oh, and, and that zero slows. Whiskey without the that slows down. Runway two nine Runway two nice. nine Taxi V L. <laughs> Another thing to remember about the differences between real airplanes and fake ones. Zero three Victor, just follow the uh, Baron crossing uh, taxiway. Cool to drag. Right. This is the tower, so it's now 12577, holding short of runway 29 Alpha, ready for takeoff with like a left downwind departure. It's 577, this ground, hold short of runway 29 or landing traffic. Holding short, 29er, 577. A little bit high, we can fix that with some. It's 5737 on request. Slip. And who had a VFR request? That's a piece of cake. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Five four zero three Victor, go ahead. Let it settle. That was my nicest landing this ever. Victor Santa Barbara Department. Oh my God. One two seven point. But stay in the center line. Don't Five, don't ruin four, it. Six, six, oh nine. my God, that was so nice. <laughs> Yes. Victor, Victor, advise when you're ready for departure. Oh my God, that was awesome. That was Fiscal Tower, Baron, and Thruins and I was ready for departure, runway 29er. This is 577, seven, Sunless Tower, runway 29 clear for takeoff. 577, seven, cleared for takeoff for runway 29. Trigger 08, Mike, I'll call your base. You'll call my base, 08, Mike. This is 176, where are you going to park? We're parking at ACI for the restaurant, 53176. 76, taxi straight out of the restaurant. Okay, straight in, 53176. Baron uh, 09 Whiskey, Salt Road, runway 29er. Salt Road, runway 29er, 3109 Whiskey. This guy's 5737, clearance available. This guy's 5737, clear to Los Angeles Airport, okay, via the Crate 3 departure. Off. Morrow Bay transition, San Marcos, S file. Maintain 4000, expect. Hey, one three thousand five brother. minutes after departure. Whoa, Santa Barbara buddy. departure frequency will be one two seven point seven two squawk four seven <laughs> seven four. Thank you, Ryan. There we go. Here's our ACI guy. Awesome. Hey, bird, Whoa, buddy. Sure, we're not blinding him. Now I had to it's figure out. Thirty seven back correct, and give me a call back about five minutes prior to push back for flow. Hey, bird. Whoa. Runway 29 clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, uh, runway 29 I'd like to have a left turn now for Santa Maria, cool. please. Runway 29 approved. Thanks, sir. Cessna 35585. All right, first, first part is down. See so you guys in a little bit. Buddy. All right, Ryan, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. We got Scotty Bob, um, hey, Giggity bird. Boo. Dalmatian, Buddy. Captain Failure, and Captain Obvious. Captains, everybody, 
welcome. Um, thank you. Thank you very much, Ryan. Uh, let me get caught up here. Oh yeah, the little the little baby Herc. Um, <laughs> taxi straight into the restaurant. Straight into the restaurant. <laughs> um, yeah. So, all right, um, Rai Gorian, thank you very much for for joining us tonight. Uh, let me let me scroll back. Puck Vanek, Puck, what's happening, man? Um, I was lurking a little bit earlier as you were you were cruising. Um, thank you very very much for for the host. Welcome everybody from Puck's stream. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna switch this really quick. Kind of um, patching together a little makeshift video here because the the file the three and a half hour file that I output um, did not work. <laughs> it's corrupted. <laughs> uh, son of a bitch. So, uh, D Money's hello. How's it going? Um, Puck, it's going great. So this is the, I'm kind of debriefing the, uh, my long solo cross country, which I did yesterday. That doesn't, that doesn't help. I told her, I said, Julia, the, the mic is hot, man. And she's, she's like drilling. <laughs> Can you hear that? Julia, for the love of God, are you drilling something? Oh, she's making muffins. <laughs> Below minimum said, stop it. And Agent B7 says, are you making a chair? <laughs> she's making muffins. Oh my God. All right. So yeah, the uh, long solo cross country, John Wayne, Van Nuys, San Luis Obispo, Oceano, back to Van Nuys. Um, this is the landing into uh, San Luis Obispo again. You can tell when a landing is good on a GoPro footage when the GoPro camera doesn't shake. It was just like, it. you couldn't tell that there was um, an actual landing that was happening. So, <laughs> she's building something. Uh, she's making muffins, shenanigans. <laughs> Um, so yeah, here is the landing again oh, into no. San Luis Obispo oh, no. and, um, Zed, thank you very much for the follow, uh, and Agent B7, what I was talking about when I hit the flaps was that it actually, um, the plane slowed down versus the rep pack when you put the flaps in, it doesn't actually slow down. So the drag, <laughs> you're not doing five, <laughs> let us keep. Keep racking it up, right? <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so when you put the the flaps down, it actually slows the plane down, even though you're descending, which is really a nice change from doing this in in the sim. Uh, what speed do you land at full flaps? Um, like land or approach? Because I'm like my approach speed is 65, but I'm actually it doesn't stop really flying until you know like the high 40s or something um it, yeah and uh b7 it could be just like a um uh you know the 172 but yeah 61 approach so i i try to aim for like my my like descent speed is like 65 but yeah, 61. I mean, the plane will fly. I mean, we've done uh, we've done slower than that. <laughs> Brad does not mind going slow. So we've we've done 58, 60, you know, and especially on a short approach. Um which you'll see in the next the next one is a short approach. So here we go. Yeah, Baron crossing uh, taxiway at cool drag. Right. Yeah, it so just keeps the towers. That's not one two five seven seven. Holding short of runway two nine alpha, ready for takeoff yeah, with like a he left does look slow. departure. To land in a one seventy two. He usually does not like flying slow. Five seven seven seven. Let's short of runway two nine. Landing traffic. 
Holding short, two niner, five seven seven. So I felt like I was a little high a little bit here. High, we can fix that with some. It's fifty seven thirty seven on request. So I slipped a little bit, kept the and center line, which, which, which was good. That's a piece of cake. Oh, that's nice. That hmm. is nice. Five four zero three Victor, go ahead. Let it settle. That was my nicest landing ever. Victor Santa Barbara Department. Oh my God. But stay in the center line. Don't Spot don't ruin four, it. Six, <laughs> six, oh nine. my God, that was so nice. <laughs> uh, Cyberwolf, a slip is when you put in. Yes. Uh, rudder, in this case, right Pull rudder and left rudder. Oh, oh my altitude. God, that was awesome. TG Seal, thank you for the follow. Welcome. Where's the landing ray plug-in? I need... 577, send us to our runway 29, clear for takeoff. 577, clear for takeoff for runway 29. Yeah, the no pappies and Vassy like in Van Nuys is definitely going to park for sure. We're parking at ACI for the restaurant, 53176. 76, taxi straight out of the restaurant. Okay, straight in, 53176. Baron 091, still short of runway 29. All right, so let's... Was gonna fast forward through here. So one, um, so I went to have lunch at the restaurant, which is right over there to the left. Um, once I get back in the plane, I will leave it to GoPro Bill from San Luis Obispo all the way to Oceano. Uh, there was a couple of, um, <laughs> oh, look at, uh, okay, nice. Um, there was a couple of times that the camera cut out and so there's a little there's a couple of little cuts in there but the approach into Oceano is freaking awesome I had a California chicken sandwich so it's chicken breast avocado um, Brussels sprouts it was super good some mustard do we Ernie, I actually talk about Bobble Bill, and I do it in the plane. <laughs> um, uh, Jimmy, it was a Cessna 172S model, um, and it took. This was a 4.1 flight. Okay, so let's. Uh, I'll go to GoPro, and I mean, I'm I'm in streaming mode, kind of when. I'm flying, so I'm constantly talking, but I'll be in the chat, obviously, so hopefully that is fine. Um, okay, so I'm going away now. All right, hey, everybody. We're back uh, for the second half of the solo long cross-country flight. We're at San Luis Obispo, and a quick flight to um, Oceano, which is right on the ocean, pretty much. Um, cool view. I can't wait to see this airport in person. Um, and then we're going to head back down to John Wayne. Uh, let's get, uh, just getting everything kind of situated here in the cockpit, making sure the DG is set. Um, got the ATIS for San Luis Obispo. We have Zulu and then, uh, we'll contact ground and, and get a departure out of here, but we look like we're okay. Let's pull up the taxi diagram just so we can... Pretend like we know what we're talking about. Okay. San Luis Ground, Skyhawk 53176. The information Zulu over at the restaurant parking. Uh, taxi for a south departure. November 53176, San Luis Ground, runway 29 or taxi via Alpha. All right, 29 or via Alpha 53176. And we're headed over to Oceano. Um, we'll just stay with you guys until we're out of your, your airspace. Cessna 176, Roger. Okay, so 29 or via Alpha. Looks like we're clear. All right, that fuel truck is on his way. Got the window open because I am sweating like crazy. It's not that hot up here. Um, it's just bright in the sun and getting, doing all the pre-flight stuff was kind of warm. And, uh, 
it's 91. So what I was saying about it's not really that hot is incorrect. It felt nice at the restaurant um, being in uh, the shade, but this is not in the shade. This is Central California, Central Coast, and it we're on the uh, on the coast, but it's still really hot. Um, so I'm really happy about how the first leg went by landing at Van Nuys. I don't know if the camera captured that or not, um, but it was pretty bad. Just kind of bounced. I mean, it wasn't like a disaster. I just yeah, I bounced it a couple times. Uh, it was on. It was smooth enough. It just just bounced it. Um, and then my landing into San Luis here uh, was the best landing that I've ever had. Uh, it was super smooth, center line. I kind of let it drift after the on the on the roll, the landing roll. Um, but overall, I was really happy. I had 40 miles basically to prepare for that landing versus you know just craziness into Van Nuys. That's going to be my excuse on that one, even though it's just that my palms are sweating and it just they're not all good. So I'm going to try to get uh, two more really good ones. Uh, Oce Oceano is uncontrolled and you know right off the right off the water um pretty cool airport i'm like i said i'm really excited to see this thing and then it's going to be a long haul back you know long cessna 172 long haul back to john wayne and um back to familiarity it's going to be weird going into john wayne having been uh, away from there i remember the first couple uh, cross crunchies that I did it was it's weird coming back into John Wayne uh, because it's so familiar and when you are coming from some place that's really not familiar and you're not used to going to unfamiliar airports uh, it was kind of a cool a cool feeling to feel like you're back home and back in a comfort level so that was an interesting um, experience so let's get our pre uh, takeoff checklist going so we've got flight Controls are free and correct. No one flipped the cables while we were having lunch. That looks good. Check the trim. So we got fuel on both mixture, cut off, throttle, flaps are up. We've got the appropriate lights are on, master's mags. Uh, okay, so let's get our run up going here. Check check the mags. There's, there's 1800. Good drop on the left. Helicopter 53 Charlie, runway 29 o'clock for the app. Good job on the right. It's good. Let's check idle. Past 700, the amp should drop. The alternator kicks off. And now we're back. Okay. All right, so um, we're going to go left crosswind departure. We're going to follow. There's like a uh, freeway that we're going to follow down to the coast. And um, we're going to be on with their Unicom, which is 22.7. Uh, 22.7 is Oceano, and we'll let them know where we're at. Hopefully not make too much of a mess of that. And then we'll contact Santa Barbara Approach on our way out of there for John Wayne. Okay. Uh, everything seems to be... In Working order. Good. Okay. Let's -a go. Oh yeah, let's give you guys the good view. San Luis ground system at 5269 November at site November. Requesting taxi to 29 with Zulu. Set to 5269 November, San Luis ground, runway to 9 or taxi via Alpha. Taxi via Alpha to 2-9. Okay, there we go. Alrighty, so our pre-takeoff checklist is complete. So let's, we're squawking VFR as well. And we got more check on the lights. Looking good. 227. St. Louis Tower, good evening. Skyhawk 53176 holding short 2-9er with a left crosswind departure. SF to 
Pine Tree 176, Sunless Tower, hold short, runway 29 or traffic departing ahead. Okay, holding short, runway 29 or 53176. Helicopter 53, Charlie, have a taxi to the west side parking across the grass to Mike. We had a grass to the west side, uh, 53 Charlie, thank you. Okay, the helicopter's getting out of our way. Cover taxi. Get a move on, bro. And he's taxiing all the way down there. That dude was doing uh, pattern work the entire time I was eating. Auto rotations. It's after 176, left crosswind departure approved, runway 29 or clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 29 or left crosswind departure approved, 53176. It's our uh, Santa Barbara approach, 27725. Is that the best off of Oceano for departing for flight following? Cesta 176, affirmative. Thank you, sir. Okay, lights, camera, action, mixture full. Okay, everything's latched. Everything is secured. There's the center line. Let's head to Oceano. Thank you, San Luis Obispo, for being so nice on my long solo cross country. Everything's in the green, airspeed is alive. Awesome. Okay, so now we're up. I think the camera shut off again, but we just departed San Luis Obispo and we're gonna follow this freeway to Oceano. It's gonna keep us at a thousand um, I mean, MSL AGL, we're just right, we're right, uh, I, uh, we're a little bit higher now. So, Oceano, the pattern altitude is just a thousand feet. So, I don't want to climb too high before um, getting into their airspace. So, just, just enough to follow this freeway here and stay a thousand feet above anything, and we're going to be well above that. So, Nice takeoff from San Luis Obispo. Cut the 4 Alpha Julia, San Luis Tower, runway 2 9 continue. 9 continue, 4 Alpha Julia. All right, and basically right when we get to the ocean is where um, the San Luis airspace ends. So it really is not not much further. But following this freeway is makes it super easy. You can kind of see it from here. And we're back. All right, so I'm going for the pier right now, and that's gonna be a good check-in point for Oceano, and it also will make the crossover uh, over midfield a little bit more of a perpendicular 45, and it's gonna be more of a 45. That looks good. And pattern altitude is 1,000, so I'm not too far from that right now. Lights are all still on. Oceano traffic, uh, Skyhawk is 1,200 descending to 1,000 over the pier inbound. We're going to cross over midfield, enter a left downwind 2 niner Oceano. Oh, look at the dunes. That's so cool. And this frequency sounds very quiet. So we don't have anybody to fight with to get in here. And it's a 2,300 foot runway, so it is shorter than your average. But we're right, right on a 45 to cross. 
And there's pattern altitude. So that is good. Don't see or hear anyone. Oh, we've got some whales off the coast, so that's cool. <laughs> Looking for traffic, and I see some blowholes. Some breaching whales, that's ridiculous. There's a bunch of them out there. Pay attention. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk 1000. It's about to cross midfield, entering a left downwind for 2-9 Oceano. already bugged from San Luis Obispo. There is a thousand. Man, those dunes are pretty. Okay. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk entering a left downwind for a two niner Oceano. beam the numbers technically and we'll square this off into a nice downwind Oceano traffic, Skyhawk turning left base, 2-9er Oceano. Okay, good. There's the road that kind of parallels it. Keep an eye on that. Okay, good. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk is turning final, 2-9er Oceano. Look at this airport. That is so cool. Whoa. Yeah, 2,300 feet is not very long. Nice short field, like we've been practicing. Shouldn't be a problem. Ooh, another, another good one. Nice. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk is clear of 2-9, taxi back, 2-9, Oceano. Wow, that felt like another good one. All right. And let's check in with Brad. going to get um, flight falling in the air once we're out of Oceano here, which, God, this is a cool little airport. Holy crap. Um, nobody's here, which is a shame at the moment. Well, I mean, it is, it is a Thursday afternoon, but I'm taking advantage of the fact that this is here, and my God, that was a cool approach. All right, let's 
sly neighborly. Okay. All right. So let's uh, load my flight plan in here for uh, John Wayne. Uh, let's see here. Where L52 John Wayne? Yeah, there he goes. And we're going to send that to Maps. And there is our John Wayne. Okay, uh, we're going to be going to use the cruise time to prep for the uh, coastal route, but we're going to go up to 5,500 from here, but we're going to depart, we're going to do a downwind departure um, right now out of Oceano. So everything looks good here. Um, that was freaking amazing. And now it's time to get out of Oceano. Cool. Okay. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk is departing 29, departure to the east, left downwind departure 29er, Oceano. Okay, uh, it's kind of a short field. So we can put in, we can put in some flaps and give, I mean it's obviously well within our performance, but let's uh, Give us plenty of space. We have clear on the right, clear on the left. Mixture is in. Good. Okay. It's full power, everything's in the green. Okay, everything is still in the green. Airspeed is alive. And we are up. Keep that nice climb going here out to the coast. Keep the climb coming. BX. Looking good. Good. Okay, flaps can come up. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk turning left crosswind, Oceano. Okay, and our airspeed is good. We're, we've got a nice climb going here. And there's just a bunch of freaking whales out here. That's crazy. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk is left downwind for a two niner eastbound departure, Oceano. bunch of guys with ATVs and stuff on the dunes, that is pretty cool. Really cool. Alright, so Santa Maria is close by, so let's pick up uh, flight following as soon as we can as we get out of Oceano airspace. Oceano traffic, Skyhawk is climbing through 1200, departing to the east, last call, Oceano. Santa Barbara approach, good evening. Skyhawk 53176, 1,500, climbing 5,500. 
176, Santa Barbara Pro uh, your type aircraft, and are you doing survey work? Here we're at Charlie 172 Slant Gulf, and we just departed Oceano. I'd like to pick up flight following to John Wayne via the coastal route. And uh, Cessna 53176, Santa Maria Altimeter, 299 or 710, you'll be leveling off at 5,500. Yes, affirmative, 5,500, 53176. Cog 53176, squawk 4667. 4667, 176. Pension all aircraft, Santa Maria, Santa Maria, ADIS information, Fox, drop down current. Three one seven six radar contact eight miles northwest Santa Maria Airport two thousand one hundred. Cool. Santa Barbara, good afternoon. Eight seven six uniform Charlie one one thousand descending nine. So that so is have, uh, San Lewis in sight with Zulu. Pretty easy. Uh, eight seven six uniform Charlie Santa Barbara. Let's just keep Pro climbing. Zulu, we want to stay away from Santa Maria. Straight which we're kind of headed towards right now. Uniform, Charlie. I can see it. To some extent, <laughs> to some extent, it was snooze, <laughs> snooze cruise. So I'll do a brief, um, not re, yeah, a brief recap of what happens. Um, I'm flying to Santa Maria. There was some traffic departing, so I had to get vectored around. Then I went straight to San Marcos. Got bumped around by the. Um, the mountain turbulence, and then it was just straight shot from uh, San Marcos right into uh, um, to the transition to, to LA. So I'm going to flip over really quick to to this, um, so I can track a little bit just to save you from the weirdness of looking. Is that Premiere. Here's me blabbing away. There, there is a blab session that is kind of funny, and let's see if I can find it. Oh yeah, here, here it is. Okay. Dondo Beach. So visibility is pretty good. Okay. Uh, well, well, Catalina, I'll, I'll pick I can up see from Catalina. Here it's we'll not the unlimited, from here. but it's pretty good. So if I can see Catalina from here, that is uh, many battery 60 packs, miles, so. 65 battery miles. Packs are so small, I would, but. then it's a little, I can see all of Catalina. So it's probably close to 70 miles of visibility, which is pretty good. It's not unlimited uh, during the, the fall, uh, winter, winter and spring, we had so much rain and it cleared. I mean, it was just crazy. I mean, you, from here, I could see Mexico. So I could go Mexico. Uh, high desert, Santa Barbara, uh, not quite here because of the mountain obstruction, but Palm Springs, all at the same time. And it's unbelievable when it's that clear. This is probably pretty typical. I can see the in inversion layer that's sitting over the basin right now. It's a little hazy, but it's still very good visibility. Um, it was still a little bit hazy up here. Uh, it wasn't as clear as I thought, but it was way clearer than it is up here, or down here. I haven't heard anybody on Point Magoo. Rollers with you on uh, 128.65, still looking to drop. 124, Papa, Papa, Magoo, Papa, 2 to 2, 9, 9, 9, 3. 9, 3, Papa, Papa. Let's just kind of check in. Skyhawk 53176, contact SoCal Approach 134.2. Okay, 3425176, see ya. See ya. See ya. That was a good one. SoCal Approach, Skyhawk 53176-5500. Five, three, five, three, six, Skyhawk 53176, SoCal Approach, Birmingham Square 2992, and uh, how you plan on navigating the Bravo? I'm going to be taking the coastal route southbound 5500 53176. 0176, you're clear to the broad view of the coastal route and maintain VFR 5500. 
Okay, we're clear to the Bravo via the Coast Rail. We'll maintain 5,500, 53176. So we are, <laughs> we are 10 miles, no less than that. We're eight and a half miles Charlie east of Camarillo. Camarillo's right there. <laughs> and it's got cleared, cleared to the Bravo. So since I've already, um, Input all of the navigation stuff for the coastal route. I've got the uh, the OBS set for my radial for the coastal route. Um, I don't have to touch anything. Like it's already uh, identifying the LAX VOR. It's not a hundred percent. There's kind of it's it's coming in and out a little bit. But um, since I'm already cleared, as soon as I hit that radial, I'm turning on to it and cleared through. So I've already been cleared through the Bravo. Um, but via the coastal route transition. So that means I, I'm not clear to just go through the Bravo any way I want. I have to go on that radial at this altitude. And the great thing about this transition is I'm on autopilot. I don't need to be off autopilot. All I have to do is turn the heading bug onto the radial once I'm on it, and it will, I'm at 5,500, and just follow uh, the the radial, the VOR in, and at some point you can actually visually see. Uh, uh, you can only visually see things. You can see the LAX VOR, and you can fly straight to it versus um, navigation. But we have everything set up, ready to go. Oh, this is so great! Oh, this is so great. And we're making good time too. Which is, Four for zero traffic inside. which is just a bonus. Seven Delta Papa, traffic has inside as well. Okay, what do you think about looking forward? Um, I understand that this is not live, so asking you is just a bit. I'm going to imagine what you're saying. Below minimums is going to make some comment about looking at my face. Ryan is going to do a little upward carrot and saying agree. Brad is going to say shut up. No one cares. Brad's not going to say that. Um, Captain Darkon is going to say something funny. I don't know. But hello, everybody. Hello, Ernie. Hello, Iowa. Hello, Ryan. Hello, all the Ryans. Hello, RC and Cessna and High Wing Driver. Hello, San beautiful San Fernando Valley. And of course, Goldsy, whose voice I wish I was hearing right now and Marcus, and Brandon, or Keith, and Cat Strader, and Max. Hello everybody if you're watching this. Thank you for, thank you for watching this. Okay, I'm gonna start hugging the 101 a little bit more now. November 84 Papa, contact point Magoo 128.65. But ultimately, we are going to go to forward cam. Now. 10 to 11 o'clock, about a mile, same direction as Skyhawk 5500. Remember, this is the raw one that I'm supposed to cut this thing out. <laughs> Oh my god. I love all you guys. I'm sorry if I missed if I didn't if I if I missed saying hi. Thanks to Jeremy Charlie. for the follow as well. It's better if you leave that. <laughs> 
If this stupid mount was just... I have to tweak it a little bit, but... Okay, so there is forward camp. Sorry I missed you. Forward camp is okay. Oh, no, there it goes. <laughs> forward camp is a little bit finicky today. Hello, Scooby. <laughs> okay, back to... Back to uh, in-flight, Bill. <laughs> Four zero frequency. Return. Might need a new mount. Such a stupid crap. Okay. Like a forward cam now. Three minutes later. Four four zero. You can be turning westbound, uh, or are you still going to continue the more northwestbound uh, heading? Uh, headed westbound. Four four zero. Four four zero. Roger. I have trying to say twelve o'clock, about five miles off the direction. A like the about to level off at five thousand. <laughs> there was a traffic alert in the background there. 144 traffic, 1 o'clock, 5 miles, turning westbound now at Skyhawk, 4,300. Look at any picture that 144. November 10, Echo, contact approach, 124. Alright, so I can see the uh, Sepulveda Pass, which I'm going to be a beam uh, before I turn. So that's in sight. I got Van Nuys in sight. Burbank is in sight. So that's all good. Right now, no factor. Descend and maintain 4,000. Descend and maintain 4,000. Big strike 144. Howdy, SoCal, Alaska 486, 8.7, down to 7. Alaska 46, SoCal, approach the Cedric Silex, and set the low plaza. Descend and maintain 5,000. Truck Tilex down to 5,000, intercept the localizer for right, uh, Alaska 486. Big 144, cross Tilex at above 4,000, clear out of Zulu runway 8. Cross Tilex at above 4,000. Okay, got Alaska Island flight above us. This is where the traffic really picks up. And I think this frequency in particular. Let's look out south of 16.5 with you at 8,000 feet. Information Mike at Burbank. Alpha 1625, so got the parts, Burbank altimeter, Q9 or 9 or 2, expect to visit the post from 8 or the ILS. We're ready. Oh, there's a uh, Burbank arrival coming in parallel to me right now, it's pretty sweet looking. So, Cal, Cessna 46826, the Empire request. If you have a request, give me about uh, two minutes. Okay, so we're still not, the radio is still not coming in yet, but we're, we're headed towards the, po the point uh, perpendicularly where we'll pick it up on quickly. So once, once that starts to come alive, we'll plan the right turn. Getting some mountain wave off the uh, Malibu Mountains or whatever those are called. Are those Malibu Mountains or something? Alpha 1625, it's going to maintain 5,000. Mulholland. Alpha 1625. Socala, citation 1012, whiskey, out of 9.5 for 7,000. 1012, whiskey, Socala, for a charger. Okay. To confirm, we have been cleared into the Bravo. Via the coastal route. And we're going to be turning before the Sepulveda Pass, which is just beyond that little reservoir, which you cannot see probably at all. Great. So, Cal Big Sharp 106 8000, uh, would like straight into 15 Airport site. Big Sharp 106, so Cal Approach, for Bank Altimeter 2992, I have your request. Okay, we're on 34.2, and then we're going to be 27.2 on the way out. We can have that thing going. So 34.2 and 27.2 on the other side. And our needle is starting to come alive here, slowly. 
but it should be coming pretty quick here once once it gets moving. We're not quite there. Not quite there, but it is alive, so that's good. Number nine nine one four Juliet, contact approach one. I would say in about thirty more seconds before we'll turn direct to the LAX VR. Number one Juliet, whiskey. Just gonna wind you out a little bit for spacing. Fighting one four zero, join the final. Just gonna maintain five thousand. Okay, right one four zero down to five thousand and join the final. Uh, okay, so pull it a pass is directly. In front, just right, right, right there. That's the Sepulveda Pass. 405. That's the 405, which goes to the uh, through the Sepulveda Pass. Clear visual approach 15. Maintain 3000 to establish. Big travel 105. Okay. Correction one. And I'm going to start turning on uh, heading right now. Can I approach 134.9er? Okay, 34, 349 or 53176. That sucked. Mic button sucks. SoCal Approach, Skyhawk 53176, 5,500 on the coastal route southbound. Uh, 53176, SoCal Approach, one scan out to number 2990. Alright, 2990, 53176, thank you. Barrow, 9090, there we go. Okay. So turning on to the VOR, the LAX VOR right now. And our Jeep, our trace on four flight is perfect. I timed that turn nicely, so we're now on the uh, on the correct um, radial, and it's confirmed on both the the tack chart um, lines and uh, the OBS right now. And now I can see the the LAX VOR, and I can both. So now I have I have three methods of flying this route. I can go visually direct to the VOR, which is at the end, uh, basically in between the coast and the departure end of the runway. Um, and then I can also go on the VOR, and I can also look at four flight. So I have multiple uh, multiple ways to check that I am in fact going in the the correct direction. And that makes me feel really, really good being inside the LAX Bravo and being fully confident I know what I'm doing. <laughs> or no, I not know what I'm doing. No, know where I am. Five climbs to five thousand four five. Makes me makes me happy. We're tracking it. Four five Yankee to right one six zero. Turn the right heading one six zero four five Yankee. Got the uh, the Getty Museum. So if you were, uh, if you've watched the first part of this doing the special flight rules transition, uh, you can see how much of a difference this uh, this route is. It's totally silent, and we probably won't hear much on this. And there's a couple of reasons for that. One is this is a published uh, transition, so we're not going to have any. Um, traffic conflicts at this altitude on this route unless they're on the route and they're going to be controlled by ATC and we're in the Bravo. So you're not going to just have some guy flying in here, Nordo, uh, not talking to anybody. We're going to... It's super safe. Um, versus the special flight rolls where you, know, you don't have to have that positive uh, ATC control. So there's a chance that you can have somebody that is... Um, not really doing things correctly, 
But here, I mean, obviously, there's always a chance for people not doing things correctly. But um, with this, even though there's a uh, long haul heavy guy right there, there's another plane there. We've got two guys departing LAX. Somebody else just flew under me a couple, King Air 7, 7, couple minutes 7, ago. 1, 1, um, there's planes everywhere, but they're all under uh, ATC control, and we're yeah, in the Bravo. Right on, so Cal approach on uh, the to that or not. Santa Santa two, seven, seven, NG. And we got Santa Monica right below us. Like there's just there's so much happening right now, um, but because we're using flight following and ATC to our advantage, it makes all of this craziness um, so much easier to manage um, while while still being uh, VFR. And this this is as IFRE as you can get uh, with a you know, being VFR, being in the Bravo with Los Angeles um, approach. You know, I'm, I'm flying specific headings. Uh, you're just, you know, you're not on actual approaches or anything. They didn't, they didn't clear you for any specific location. We're almost to LAX. Let's see if uh, we can pick up John Wayne. Advise on initial contact. You will have information uniform. Okay, so uniform is current. John Wayne Air Force ATIP information uniform. 23530. Wind 210 at 7. 7, that's okay. Visibility 10. Sky clear below 12. Archer South with 6231. 1000 for 2, All right, we're coming up on the LAX VOR, so now we're going to be left. One two three radio off the LAX VOR, and that's a very slight left turn. Obviously, we're right now. We are. Uh, what's our course? Uh, Sixty-two thirty-one. Turn left. Our track is one four two, so it's you know, twenty degrees. South uh, sixty-two thirty-one. To the left. Right. Uh, excuse me. Heading two five zero. Flying over LAX is pretty freaking rad. 3435 77 NG. Okay, so here we are on the radial, uh, right about now. The uh, OBS just went all crazy, so now we're on a 1 2 3 radial outbound. So slight turn to the left. We are listing lazily to the left. Just like Han Solo. And freaking crazy LAX beneath us. This is just an unbelievable view of LA. It's, it's so wild. It makes it feel like it's tiny. You can see everything. I mean, and, and most of that is because with the traffic the way it is, uh, you know, if you, if you imagine going from LAX to, I can see way past Riverside, San Bernardino from here, that would take you like three hours. <laughs> and, this is, and I keep forgetting that it's uh, during the week. So it is like, it's rush hour right now. It's five o'clock. 405 is completely, completely jammed. We just got jammed. And there's... It's kind of fun identifying all the airports too, and just continuing, continuing to uh, look for landmarks and um, places to land. So, like, I got Hawthorne out my left. I've got Torrance right there. Which I, can you see Torrance? It's kind of right, so Cal, right there ish. So that's Torrance. I can easily glide there. Um, and I've got Compton. I can reach Compton, and I can reach Hawthorne, and I've got LAX. We'll do our if things really went bad. 
Idaho 40, I understand you're gonna, you want to go over to Dodger Stadium and then uh, just send over there? Hey, Bermuda's. Idaho 40, uh, Roger. For now, just maintain your current altitude. Let me coordinate with your aisle controller. We'll go, maintain. 76, kind of approach, 127.2. Okay, 27253176. Idaho 40, cut a count. 4,500 a piper. Traffic 3 o'clock, looking for traffic 18 Yankee. Number 18 Yankee, altitude, your discretion. Uh, I'll be cruising at 4,000 for a little bit while, 18 Yankee. Number 18 Yankee, Roger, distant traffic now 11 o'clock and 3 miles just turn eastbound, altitude indicates. 4,000 and might be descending. 3,900 now indicated. Descent to 3,900, 18 Yankee. Number 18 Yankee, uh, negative. That traffic is descending now. 11 o'clock, 2 miles to sound, 3,900. Uh, Third climb to uh, better above 4,300 percent traffic. Climb up more than 4,000. What's the climb you want me to climb up to? 18 Yankee. Number 18 Yankee, just start a VFR climb, please. Start a VFR climb, 18 Yankee. SoCal Approach, Skyhawk 53176, 5,500, we've got uniform at John Wayne. 900. Crap. SoCal, I do have that traffic in, at site at 12 o'clock, 1 Yankee. Number 1 Yankee, Roger. Number 6, Charlie, Charlie, reduce to 200 for sequence. SP200, 46, Charlie, Charlie. SoCal Approach, Skyhawk 53176, 5,500 southbound on the coastal route with uniform at John Wayne. Number 53176, SoCal Approach, Roger, someone else better, 290. 290. SoCal Approach, 2897, 8.8 8 on the in. uniform, request the RNAV Zulu. Roger, 2897, SoCal Approach, Roger, on request. All right, we're following our track perfectly. That makes me feel good for my flight planning skills. Uh, looks like Catalina has some crazy marine layers, so something is creeping in, but it's offshore. Yankee, are you landing Torrance, or you headed somewhere else? It's offshore quite a bit. Torrance, Yankee, just doing the climb at About 20 miles offshore. Number one eight Yankee, So we probably will have marine layer tonight. So here's Long Beach, right below us. Long Beach Harbor is kind of in this area there. Queen Mary is right there, right there. So far, approach where we're through one Yankee is at 4,600. Do you still want me to climb one Yankee? Number one eight Yankee, altitude is your discretion if you've got that traffic in place. One eight Yankee. This poor guy. <laughs> Got a departure, Falcon 210, Fox Juliet 1.3, climbing 3,000. November 416, Charlie, Charlie, contact approach 121.3. 123, 46, Charlie, Charlie. November 210, Fox Juliet, Juliet, so out a first radar contact, fighting 200, by three fine. 210, Fox Juliet, heading 200. There's Torrance down there. Still have not been to Torrance off my right wing. That's a pretty cool airport. There's some cool stuff going on there, like RVs. Oh, no, uh, not RVs. Slings, I think, are built there. Uh, Robinson has their main factory, maybe? I know that's kind of random, considering you're looking out towards San Diego, and I'm talking about things behind me. Okay, I will be looking for traffic on AMP. Thousand. 28-1 probably. Let's go to 28-1 maybe and hope that that's... Number 210 Fox, uh, Juliet, climb maintain 4,000. 210 Fox, Juliet, climb 4,000. Number 53176, turn left heading 090 short back over traffic. All right, left 090 for traffic, 53176. Number 210 Fox, uh, Juliet, traffic 1 o'clock, 2 miles turning east down assessment 5,500. Additional traffic 11 o'clock, 4 miles northwest down 4,500 here. 210 Fox, short work searching. Okay, coming to two or zero nine or zero. Seven six traffic eleven o'clock a mile southwest down of Falcon. We'll climb off your right three thousand five hundred. Okay, I have him inside five three one seven six. There he is. Falcon right below us. 
Number 210 Fox Five Zero Eight, traffic no factor, climb maintain 7,000. 210 Fox Five Zero Eight, climb 7,000. Number 4318, ECVFR descent approved at your discretion, the traffic no factor. Traffic no factor, 18 Falcon is climbing. Number 210 Fox Five Zero Eight, Cherokee, traffic no factor. Crazy. 210 Fox Five Zero Eight, Cherokee. Number 7 Zulu, Zulu, Soco. Number 210 Fox Set Juliet, turn left heading 180, contact approach 134.35. 210 Fox Set 180, 3435. Look up, bro. May we start our VFR descent? 8 Fox Set Fox Set. Number 8 Fox Set Fox Set VFR descent approved. Just 8 Fox Set Fox Set altitude, your discretion. I'll do my discretion, 8 Fox Set Fox Set. Number 4318, you can contact Torrance Tower 133.07. Contact Torrance Tower 133.07. Thank so you this frequency is a little busier. Thank you, have a good day. We're almost out of the Bravo. So hopefully she'll get us over to uh, 2897, Coastal. 121.3 and they'll let you know if you have the Zulu approach. All right, thank you. Horizon 2097 switching. Number 2545, Yankee, contact approach 121.3. 121.3, S4, you have 45 Yankee, hello, good day. Good day. Number 53176, resume on navigation, proceed to the Huntington Beach Pier, maintain the far at or above 3,500 and pull advice. Okay, we'll be direct to the pier and keep it above 3,500, 53176. Number 428, Fox, Fox, traffic, 10 o'clock, 5 o'clock. So straight to the pier, there is the pier. Let's, uh, Autopilot, Bendix King, Cap 140, I really, really appreciate you a lot. Thank you for your help today. See ya. Roger, clear through Bravo Airspace, and I will try. I'm sorry that I have to give and do this. Oh, it's, it's, um, it's not a big deal to me. It's just that guys are kind of picky in that area. No, I totally understand, and thank you guys for being so helpful. So we got to keep it above 3,500, which is Number one, seven, seven, fine. I'm sure there's a ton of coast traffic right now and lots of uh, students in the area. So that's 3,500. It's kind of hard to tell in the uh, in the GoPro footage, but so I'll, I'll tell you like we're at 5,000 feet right now. That's what this is what 5,000 feet looks like. It looks a lot higher uh, in the GoPro because of the wide angle, but it doesn't feel like we're quite that high. But five three one seven six contact approach one two five point three five and left floor for you. Okay, 2535, 53176, thanks for the help. See ya. Yeah. Yeah. That was a pretty good one. She did a good job. SoCal Approach, Skyhawk, 53176, descending through 4,600, restricted 3,500. We've got uniform at John Wayne. 53176, SoCal Approach, Roger, descend at or below 2,500. Okay, at or below 2,500, 53176. Cal approach, Roger, clear direct all this to maintain 4,000. Clear direct all this, maintain 4,000, okay. 6410. How's our descent looking? Two thousand five hundred, so we got a ways to go here. There's four thousand. So we were we were left high um, pretty late compared to the few times that I've uh, been released from the uh, coastal route. They'll usually actually release you before you exit the Bravo uh, for a VFR descent when they if they know you're going to John Wayne. 
because this is a pretty steep descent. Um, I don't know, being being at 5,000 feet off of the coast of, you know, south of Long Beach is kind of high. But you can just pull the, yeah, well, pull the power back and we just like to climb up to 3, and just hold. don't overspeed it. <laughs> Fine. We've got, kilo, we've got a healthy descent yeah. into the pier right now. And I don't know if, if you are able to see that. Six, five, six, four, seven, um, so Cal, you up. The pier is right there. So that's that's what I'm aiming for. Then you got the two um, oil rigs right there, but that's that's the pier, and that's um, really easy to spot. Um, it's got a red top, the the building, the restaurant at the end of the pier. It sticks out. Um, it's hard in the sim if you don't have a, a scenery that depicts the pier. Sometimes you can just see like the little bit, like if you got an ortho, you can just see the pier part sticking out of the sand. Um, but it's really easy to see, uh, obviously, uh, assuming you have the, the visibility to get there uh, Nine, three, in real life. So. Two, zero, zero vectors uh, for all this. Two, zero, zero vectors for Alvis, 93 Juliet. Jeff was 6410, six from easy kill, cross easy kill, 4000, clear at ILS, three, zero. So we got mixture, we got cutoff, we've got mixtures in. Appropriate lights are on for right now. We'll turn on the landing Double taxi 64, lights 10, when we're cleared. 4,000, cleared ILS 30. Cross easy kill 4,000 and cleared the ILS 30. South of 6410. Number 176, traffic 12 o'clock, 3 miles southbound, Skyhawk 2400 climbing. Hi, we're looking 176. 93 Julia, traffic, 3 o'clock, 3 miles, south eastbound, 2300, Skyhawk heading to the pier, then Orange County. Negative contact, we're looking, 93 Julia. Number 364, traffic southwest, 3 miles, north eastbound, 4,737. Gonna be looking, 364. Okay. South of 6410, traffic, 12 o'clock, 3 miles, maneuvering by easy kill, uh, 3,000, Skyhawk. Southwest 6410, uh, we're looking. 176, contact John Wayne Tower, 126.8, see ya. All right, 268, 53176, see ya. Okay. I'm going to set this up ahead of time because it's really funny. It's stupid. It's really stupid. Um, when Brad, when Brad and I, um, were talking after I told him about this and he was dying laughing cause it's, it's really funny and you'll hear the, <laughs> the controlled tower, <laughs> the tower guy, um, confused about what's, what's happening. So I am right over the Huntington beach pier and right now I'm probably at 3000 something, um, I think, yeah, I, I was I was descending down, and I was I was still in the three thousands right here at some point. Um, so <laughs> I'll explain if it's not clear what happened. I'll explain to you after it does happen. But it is pretty. It's ridiculous. I six heavy inside snake with you for two zero right. Alaska five zero nine runway two zero right clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff two zero right Alaska five zero nine. Horizon 2897, traffic left downwind, further runway south of the heavy side, maintaining visual separation, runway 20 right, clear to land. Horizon 2897, clear to land, 20 right. FedEx 556 heavy, giant tire, runway 20 right, clear to land. Clear to land, 20 right, 556. Giant tower, Skyhawk 53176, 2200 over the pier, inbound with uniform, full stop. 53176, giant tower, cross over the control tower at above 1300, enter left downwind, runway 20 left. Okay, cross, cross the tower 1,300, enter left downwind for 20 left, 53176. All right, so the typical uh, crossing procedure, uh, 1,300, at or above 1,300 over the tower, and we're going to enter a left downwind for 20 left, and that um, that's pretty, pretty standard inbound from the Huntington Beach Pier. 
it's a little, you have to dump 500 feet from the time you cross the control tower to uh, downwind, which is a little bit, uh, it's a little tricky. I mean, you have to, you do have to get it down uh, and it ends up kind of being a teardrop a little bit from from that crossover to, to downwind because you're kind of turning and descending into the downwind. Um, just the 176, maintain at or above 1,500. There's traffic that will cross below you at uh, 700, a helicopter. Okay, we'll go up to 1,500 at 53176 and look out for that traffic. So that gives them 500 foot clearance. So it's, I went from 500 foot descent uh, from the tower to downwind to. Ooh, this is going to be fun. Nice little dump it in 700 feet to pattern out. 700 feet to pattern out. Okay, so there's 2,500. This will be exciting. Chapter 7, Echo X ray, pad 3, clear to land. Three, clear to land, seven echo. Rising 2897, turn left at echo, contact ground. Left echo, ground, rising 2897. Long Beach arrival coming in, our 11 o'clock. Just the 176, say your current altitude. We've got uh, 2600 at the moment, 176. It's 176, Roger. I just want you to cross over at or above 1500, so you can start your descent, please. Just maintain at or above 1500. 1,500, 53176. That was 5831. 1,500. Son of a gun. Move across from right to left above 500 helicopter. All right, we'll be searching for that clear for takeoff. Two's the right compass, 5831. So. Whoops. traffic, two mile funnels, a heavy Airbus. Contact tower on 1199 or Okay, we'll be looking for that traffic and 199176. FedEx 556 Heavy, traffic midfield crossing right to left above 1,500 is a Cessna, runway 20 right, clear to land. Chowing Tower, Skyhawk 53176, descending through 2,000. Skyhawk 53176, Chowing Tower, Roger, Contraport Trumpets traffic, short final for the parallels and heavy airbus is 600. Contraport Trumpets traffic, up one Ember, runway 20 left, clear to land. Okay, we'll be looking out for that traffic and uh, clear to land two zero left five three one seven six. I think I see that Airbus turning. Okay, and we have the uh, the heavy Airbus inside five three one seven six. Sky one seven six, thanks. Maintain visual separation. Caution, wait, troubles from the traffic. Boca one seven six. Okay, he is just right over the freeway now. So the 53614 John Terry, you guys ready to go? Okay, firmness. So the 53614 caution, wake up in traffic on the up one to Ember. I'm going to use our left at Kilo Clip for takeoff. We'll caution on the wake okay. and uh, well, use our left to Kilo Clip. Uh, there's a difference take between a, a one and a two. So the 176 additional traffic is on a four mile final of 737 1400. Report that traffic and signs. I have that traffic in sight, 53176. Says the 176, maintain visual separation, caution, avoid trouble. 176. All right, let's get a good landing here at our at home base. Keeping this pattern brad tight. That's glare. There is two zero left. Got the departing traffic there. Sky 
Cessna 614, we had our contacts down. Center line is cool. Says a 614 contact SoCal departure. Switch on SoCal 614. Ooh, a little, little windy there. Says I'm not a Mike Charlie, I don't want to left at Kilo, line of point. Oh, I ballooned it. Says you're left at Kilo, line of and wait. 529 or Mike Charlie. That was good. Little, little tiny balloon at the end there, but. Says on 176, you park on the west side. Affirmative, we're on the west side, 176. Cessna 176, traffic is holding in position at Taxway Juliet, cross which is your right, contact ground. Okay, we'll cross 20 right at Juliet and contact ground 53176. Thanks, Alvin. See ya. See ya. Cessna, not a mic, Charlie, left, close traffic approved, and the wind is at 2207, and 20 left at Kilo, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 20 left, 529 or Mike Charlie. Oh my god. Uh, sorry, good to three Mike Lima, cut this road for traffic pattern, six past four. Tell you three Mike Lima, Joe, and I tell you, stand by. Ground Skyhawk 176, clear 20 right at Juliet, we're at ACI West. So it's 53176, Joe, we're on taxi, Bravo to parking. Bravo to parking, 176, thanks. Cheers to a controlly, contact tower, 199.9er. Nine nine for tower to a controlly. Ah! My hands are so sweaty! <laughs> oh my god! What an insane... cool thing. Oh. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me during this. Uh, however you've hung out. <laughs> Whether it's on... Twitch or YouTube or blah, 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 whatever. Thank you so much. This is so much fun. I'm so happy I was able to share uh, this with you to whatever extent um, you've watched. So I, I really appreciate it. It's, you know, the uh, production value isn't, uh, isn't super high because I'm focusing really hard on uh, flying here. So cameras going out and uh, all kinds of stuff. Um, it's <laughs> Brad is here waiting. Uh, but God, that was so much fun. That was so much fun. So, all right, guys. That's going to do it for me. Got my welcome party here. Bye.